Hey everybody, it's Munzi here. I was going to uh, give you guys an update on what the tank actually looked like during the day. Um, the tank looks cloudy through the camera. I can promise you that it's not. I don't know why my camera chose to do this today. So. But uh, anyway, I um, appreciate the views and everything. appreciate you guys keeping up with me. And I've been thinking about getting some Chromis actually in my I've been doing a lot of studying and stuff and figuring out what I should, shouldn't add and I have came up with Chromis. So But I hope you guys enjoy the video. I know it's not the the prettiest reef tank and I know it's probably not you know what you guys expect out of a reef but you know it's mine I'm making it mine and stuff and it's it's working out for me and uh, but I appreciate every bit of the input that you guys give me and yeah hold on just a minute let's we'll see if I can get this to focus in there we go. Ain't he pretty? He molds, I swear, two times a day. I mean, excuse me, a week. At least two to three times a week. He's cool. That Xenia over there, I don't know what his problem is, but he's laying down. I don't know, you know, the wind's not, I mean, the water current's not really blowing him around, but... It looks like maybe he's trying to detach down there. So it might be having to get a rubber band for that guy. Uh, this is starting to, I guess you could say, tear apart. I'm, I'm not real sure. Um, but there's, you can't really see it, but right up under it, there's a little bit of uh, new mushroom coral growing and it's still attached to this one it's just over here there's my two little turds that's what I call them those are Ocellaris clownfish for those of you who are just now seeing them. The brain coral still has not decided to open up. I wish he wasn't such a baby, but he is. I'm not sure if I've ever did an update on this or not. I'm pretty sure that I haven't. But this rock right here, that rock, that rock, uh, that one, and that one were all dead. They, they were nothing but dry rock. The rest of this was live. And I figured that would be worth mentioning. Um, I think that might have been a piece of dead rock too. But I have nowhere to place it in here. I can't. I had it up against the wall over here. And it just really didn't look right. 
So I just stuck it up there for now and it, it almost reaches the water level. Kind of makes it look like I've got more rock than what I do. There's 110 pounds in here total though, counting the dead. So I'm pretty much done with the rock. I'm not going to add any more. This is where I stop. I think I finally got it adjusted the way that I wanted it and everything and you know it's all it's all the way that I want it um if you guys have any questions on how I do stuff you know maybe another rundown on my equipment anything you know just shoot me a message or comment and I will I will make a video updating what I do to keep this tank going and I think I'll stop it there appreciate you guys watching and let me know what you think